Howdy folks. Today we are looking at the uh, SU8055 again. This is the Technics integrated amp that we've been uh, doing a lot of playing with recently. Today I want to look at something pretty simple. Uh, just this uh, little fuse box here. So most of these uh, are supposed to come with this little plastic housing uh, just to cover it up and protect the fuses. Goes there, mounts with a screw. And, you know, that's really it. Unfortunately, this particular incarnation of this amp did not have one of these little covers. This one is uh, from one of the other ones that I've got on the shelf. So I thought it might be fun to uh, measure this thing up and go uh, try and print one out. Now, one, uh, one little change I want to make as I'm designing this is... See, this fits fairly loosely here. It'll, you know, knock right off. And I want to, you know, I kind of figured that anybody who has lost uh, this little box has also lost the little screw that goes along with it. So I wanted to design it a little bit thicker so that it will stay <clears throat> just on the plastic flanges there and it'll hold nicely, even if you don't have the screw. Uh, but I still want the screw to work if you do happen to have it. So let's uh, jump over to OpenSCAD and uh, try and design this thing up. So back in the real world now, this is what we came up with out of the printer. I would say it's really not too bad. It's not as clear as the real deal, but what do you expect? Um, you know, same basic size and shape and all of that, maybe a little more rounded. You know, I didn't try to approximate the radiuses here. I just kind of, you know, made it up as I went. Um, okay, so let's see if this thing actually does the job that we want. So yeah, you can see that that hugs on there pretty nicely. It's not just going to fall off. You do have to put a decent bit of effort to get it to come off. I like that. And then if you do happen to have the screw, then that does still work. So yeah, overall, I would say I am quite happy with that. So I think uh, that's going to do for today. And thank you as always for watching. And uh, oh yeah, there will be a link to this on Thingiverse eventually uh, down in the description. So yeah, thank you as always for watching and we will see you in the next one.